everybody, folks. Jeremy and I are here today with a new uh, beverage review. This time for Mountain Dew's Pitch Black. Pitch Black. You gotta say it like this, Bubba. Pitch Black. Pitch Black. Say Pitch Black. Pitch Black. Oh. So Pitch Black, to the best of my knowledge, was one of Mountain Dew's limited edition flavors. <laughs> But uh, people loved it so much, there was such a demand for its return that um, it's back. And it's apparently back in full force. I don't think this is a limited time run. Um, I, 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 think, I think Pitch Black is here to stay. If I'm, if I'm mistaken, let me know down in the comments section below. But um, we didn't have a chance to review Pitch Black back when it was first out. So uh, here we go. So before we crack open our bottles of Pitch Black, what do you think it's going to taste like, Bubba? Think it's going to be good? Grape. Think it's going to taste like grape? I'm not sure what's going on on the label. Um, it looks like uh, a black hole is opened on the label and there's some sort of creature emerging, firing green balls. Is that what it looks like to you? Yes. Yeah. Um, so Mountain Dew Pitch Black is back. Back in Pitch Black. Kind of like the ACDC song. Yes. What's your favorite ACDC song? Black and Black. Back in Black. That's a good one. What's another good ACDC song? Who Made Who. Who Made Who? From the... Maximum Overdrive. From the Maximum Overdrive soundtrack. That's right. That's a good song. Good soundtrack. Good movie. Yes. So you think Mountain Dew Pitch Black is going to have a, a grape flavor, right? Right. Okay. Well, there's only one way to find out. I've got my bottle. You've got your bottle. Let's go ahead... Crack them open and find out, shall we? All right. Oh, yeah. That's That's got a very grape scent. That's for sure. So Jeremy is drinking his out of the bottle rapidly. I'm going to pour mine into my Jason glass. And here for all you ASMR lovers, the pour. All right. Smells grape. As for the taste, ooh, it is. Um, yeah, it definitely has a grape flavor to it. It's very sweet, but. Uh, one of my New Year's resolutions was to cut back on sweets. So I've been drinking a lot of water and a lot of Coke Zero. So this is the first uh, really sweet beverage that I've had in some time. So my taste buds are a little not used to it. But it's, it's, it's good. I think it's good. What do you think? Are you liking it? Mm-hmm. There's there's definitely grape here, but there's also another flavor I can't quite put my finger on. <coughs> you all right? Yes. It's uh, Mountain Dew with a blast of dark citrus punch flavor with other natural flavors. So dark citrus punch. That's it. So yeah, okay. I get it. I, I can taste the grape with the citrusy <coughs> citrus, right? Right. Mm. So, Jeremy, you've got your bottle just about, and there it goes, the final drop. You drank, I, I think that's a record for you, Bubba. I don't think I've ever seen you down a bottle of Mountain Dew like that, because it is it is gone. Um, so, I'm guessing you really liked the Mountain Dew Pitch Black. Yes. What would you rate it? Two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Jeremy's giving Mountain Dew Pitch Black two thumbs up. Um... Uh, here, do you want to do you want you want to finish the rest of mine? No. Nope. Oh, okay. I will. You'll save that for later, right? Right. Okay. Uh, <laughs> but um, I'm gonna give Mountain Dew Pitch Black two thumbs up as well. It's it's pretty good. Um, and it it tastes uh, it, it the the initial blast of sugar has kind of worn off as I've sipped on it some more. But it's actually it's got this very full bodied 
flavor about it. Um, and it's, it's very, um, refreshing actually. Would you describe pitch black as refreshing? Yes. Would you describe it as full bodied? Full bodied. What, how else would you describe pitch black? Cool. Cool. Okay. That should be on the label. That quote. So I think Mountain Dew Pitch Black is a hit with both me and Jeremy. Um, I'm sure Jeremy will finish the rest of my bottle of Pitch Black. And I'm probably not going to drink the rest of this glass, so I'm sure Jeremy will probably finish it off um, as well. But yeah, two thumbs up from both me and Jeremy for Mountain Dew Pitch Black. Yes. Now, who would you like to have a glass of Pitch Black with? Larry Fine. Larry Fine. Yep, I'm sure Larry Fine would, would certainly like some Pitch Black. Um, who else would you like to have a glass of Pitch Black with? Mo Howard. Let's just say the whole Three Stooges. Would, would you want to have a, a glass of Pitch Black with Mo, Larry, Curly, and Shimp? Yes. What about Joe? Yes. What about Joe Besser? Yes. Okay, so all the all the Stooges. Yes. Who else would you like to have a glass of Pitch Black with, Bubba? Leech Roman. Leech Woman. Leech Woman from Puppet Master. Okay. Do you think Leech Woman would like Pitch Black? Yes. Probably. Uh, do you think the leeches inside Leech Woman that she pukes out onto people, do you think they would like Pitch Black? Yes. What other Puppet Master puppet do you think would like Pitch Black? Blade. Blade, oh yeah. Yep. Blade would like Pitch Pitch Black a lot. What class of creature do you think would like Pitch Black more? Vampires or werewolves? Werewolves. Werewolves, yeah. Yeah, I think so too. What would a werewolf say about Pitch Black? Oh! Vampires would probably lean more toward Code Red, don't you think? Code Red. Yeah, don't you think vampires would drink Code Red? Yes. Yeah. So tell everybody what you've been up to lately, bub. Yes. What you've been up to lately? Watch a show. Watching, watching his shows, of course. That's an everyday thing. Reading books. Have you read any good books lately? Yes. What? Great Expectations. Great Expectations. Okay. All right. What's another book you've read recently? A Christmas Carol. A Christmas Carol. All right. Cool. What kind of music have you been listening to on your iPad? Grunge. Grunge. Okay. What What band specifically, though? Smashing Pumpkins. Smashing Pumpkins. What's your favorite Smashing Pumpkins song? Rocket. Rocket. That's a good one. What about uh, Mayonnaise? Mayonnaise. Patty Mayonnaise song. The Patty Mayonnaise song. I know. What What's another grunge band? You what's What's your favorite band, or what band do you love to listen to, in the car when we're out and about? Soundgarden. Soundgarden. That's right. What's your favorite Soundgarden song? Fourth of July. Fourth of July. That is a darn good Soundgarden song. Yes. Tell everybody what movie you're looking forward to next. Scream 6. Scream 6. You've got Ghostface on your shirt. Ghostface on the shirt. Are you excited? Yes. Ghostface in New York. York. Oh, man. What do you think's going to happen? Killing people. Yep, that's a good bet. That's a good, uh, yeah. Who do you think Ghostface is going to be this time? Sidney Prescott. You th oh, my God. What a revelation, Bubba. You think Sidney Prescott will be unmasked as Ghostface? Yes, Gail Weathers. Courtney you, Cox. What, you think Gail Weathers and Sidney Prescott are working in unison as Ghostface killers? Yes. Oh, my My mind is blown, Bubba. My mind is blown. Yes. What other movies are you looking forward to this year? Salem's Lot. Salem's Lot, I know. That's going to come out sometime this year, I hope. Yes. What else? At New Essence's movie. Ooh. Mm. Okay. All right. What about the new Evil Dead? New Evil Dead. Are we going to go watch Evil Dead Rise? Yes. Ooh. So Scream 6 is going to be out pretty soon. We'll probably shoot a video of us going to watch Scream 6, and we'll get Jeremy's thoughts on the film after, right? Yes. Yeah. What do you want our next food review to be? Donuts. Donuts? What kind of Donuts. Donut World. Donut World? You mean, oh, that's The Simpsons, right? Yes. <laughs> Maybe we can get some Krispy Kremes or something and we can review those. Would that yes. be fun? Yes. Okay. So to recap, Jeremy and I both give Mountain Dew a pitch black, two thumbs up. Uh, would you say this is one of your favorite Mountain Dew flavors? Yes. Again, 
you downed this bottle in record time, Bubba. I don't think that has to be a record. Yes. I don't. Re- I don't remember you drinking a full bottle of Mountain Dew during one of these reviews as quickly as you did the Pitch Black. So it must have been. It really must have hit the spot, huh? Yes. So what are we going to do after we wrap up the video? Watch your shows. What else? Go to bed. Watch your shows and go to bed? Yes. What, what are we going to get for dinner? Your dinner is Arby's. Arby's. Okay. All right. That sounds good to me. <laughs> All right. Well, let's wrap it up. You ready to wrap it up? Yes. All right. Well, tell everybody out there, say thanks for watching. Okay. Say we'll see you see next time. time. Say take care. Yeah. Say follow us on social, social media. media. Say we love you guys. Bye. Say be good. good. Say be good to each yeah. other. Say be careful. Say what else? Peace. Peace. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, you're welcome, Bubba. Can you give me a hug? A hug. Take your bath. Thank you to all my patrons and channel members. I appreciate your generosity and support of my channel. Become a patron today and have a say in what content appears on my channel. Join me for monthly live streams and much more. Become a channel member today and get access to exclusive badges and emotes to use when I stream. Both those links are in the description. Say hello to the internet, Jeremy. Hello to the internet.